Yo, what's going on? Our Hunts 24 with a uh, Kennard Jones P personal collection PC. Um, here we go. Uh, my favorite baseball player right now. Uh, well, I like. He's on the Ducks, but he was drafted by the Padres. Um, here's his rookie card. Future out of Future Gems. I got it signed this season. Pretty much a mint condition card. I would rate it an, a nine out of a ten. It's mint condition. Cool card. Great for the collection. Um, I love Major League Baseball, but I love the Ducks so much more just because I get to go to a lot of games cheap. Uh, f definitely fan friendly with the players. Like, the players love their fans, especially KJ. He's a fan of a fan. He loves his fans. Uh, Alright, here we go. Um, shout, out to, shout out to KJ. Uh, thanks for all the things you've done for me this season. And uh, here we go. I got a Game Muse Kennard Jones personal bat. It's the bat that he uses on the field. He signed it. It's an M9. It's cracked like right there. Oh, there it is. You can't really see. Uh, can't really see it, but it's got the date when it was made. I use the same exact weight and size of a bat, what I shouldn't be. I should be using like a 32 or a 31, but whatever. It's got the power no knob. Uh, this is really special to me. It's it's awesome. Like I think it's sick. Uh, Tony Gwynn Jr. San Diego Padres bat. Kennard Jones used it, so he signed it. It's got Tony Gwynn Jr.'s number in there, number 18. It's got the model number. It's got a sick handle grip. I want to know how to do that because I want to put it on my bat. Oh, uh, there's the date when the bat was made. Same size, 33, 31. With his number markings and everything. I've seen like these bats go for a lot of money on the computer. But I'm definitely not selling anything that's on... I don't like selling. I don't like selling. I like to keep my stuff. I hate when people sell shit. Excuse my language. But it's just annoying. Um, Kennard Jones autographed uh, baseball. Sweet spot on a Big Ten ball. I'm pretty sure he won a, a Big Ten championship. Not clear on that. Gonna have to ask him when I see him. Or on the computer sometime, whenever. Uh, Kennard Jones autographed 2011 Ducks certified uh, card. It's got all the statistics on the back. Really great baseball player. Averages like uh, about bats like average 300 a season. 303. Very good on base percentage. An autograph schedule. Just a plain old schedule right here. Uh, here are some 4x6s. <laughs> Autographed. Autographed. Here's on the Newark Bears. Here's like the rookie card, but a picture. This is before I even found the card on the computer. I bought the card off the computer for like 5 bucks. <laughs> That's pretty. Well, that's a lot of money for a base card, but it's a rookie card, so. And plus, I wanted to get it signed for my collection, so it was worth it. Because he's a really good baseball player. <laughs> I took this picture myself. Um, I got this picture in a frame. It's signed. Of me and him on the field before the game. <laughs> giving out autographs to his fans. Great baseball player. Uh, got a uh, an interview for him. I like the Orioles. Kenny Lofton, amazing baseball player. He got hit in the head, I think, by Scott Casimir. But and there's his autograph down there. Got a Duck scorecard signed by the whole team. He is right there. Uh, Bridgeport Bluefish lineup card. When they played the Ducks. Here's another line of card. Not signed. 
signed by most of the players. He's up there. A Road Warriors lineup card signed by the Ducks. Missing KJ's auto on there. What the frick? I don't know what happened there. Uh, oh. Yeah, Kennard didn't play this game. I think he was hurt or something. Or, I don't think he was hurt, but I don't remember. Oh, it was a double header, that's why. But he played the next game. Um, this is on my wall. Oh, man, the picture fell. Shh, Nikes. Uh, that's Craig Binnick. There's a picture behind there. Signed by all the Ducks. Mask Ravel. KJ. The two gift. This one's signed by every single Duck. That's cool. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for everything, man. Appreciate it. Everybody should go down and support the Ducks. Really fine ball club. Made it pretty far this season. I think uh, they could have won it all, but stuff just doesn't fall everybody's way sometimes. But uh, keep on your grind. Do what you got to do. Hopefully one day you make it back to the majors. That'll be, that'll be crazy. All right. Later, man. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention he he's his father in law is Tony Gwynn. That's that's nuts. That's that must be so f so cool hanging out with him sometimes. He's married to his daughter. I'm pretty sure at the last game at the Ducks when he gave me this bat, I'm pretty sure when I sat down because I was sitting by John Rodriguez's uh, daughter and like his wife because my ticket. I had like a double, there was two tickets for the same seat for some reason, so I said, oh, whatever. So John Rodriguez's mom told me to sit by her, so I did. I'm pretty sure KJ's wife was there. I was sitting right next to her, and she's like, oh, why do you like KJ and everything? I'm like, oh, he's an amazing baseball player, uh, plays with his heart. Uh, I forgot what I said, I said a lot. And then she's like, oh, yes, and I, I really like him too, and I was like, oh, really? And she looked familiar, but I was like, no way. I don't think so. And sure enough, I saw a picture with KJ and her, and I was like, damn it. I was like, wow, that was her. I was like, oh, whatever. Hopefully see her sometime again. All right. Thanks for watching. Later.